Chris asks, can the firmware be updated on the 878 and 578? And if so, uh, are the update, where are the updates found? And how do you know, uh, okay, where did it go? And how do you do it? Good question, that went off the screen there for a second for me. Awesome, yeah, thanks. Thanks for the question, Chris. So the updates are actually gonna be found on our support page and we actually have YouTube videos and, and, and videos in Bridgecom University that will show you how to do that. So let's jump over here and take a look. Let's see. So if we go over here, open up a web browser, and we'll go to Bridgecom Systems. Oops. Bridgecomsystems.com. Here we go. And once you're here, uh, just go to resources. Let's see here. Nope, actually it's gonna be under support. They changed a few things around recently. So it's gonna be under support at the, at the front. And once you are here, uh, you should be able to find your radio. So you talked about firmware. So we can have the 878 or the 578 here. Uh, if you wanna see more, you can click on the, on the see all down here. But in this case, let's say we want an 878 V2. Uh, we just click on that and we'll have all the different versions there. And you can obviously download them, upgrade your firmware, whatever you'd like. So hopefully that answers your question. As for how to do it, we have some videos on it. Uh, it's pretty simple. And if you have more questions, definitely give us a call.